What's up guys, welcome back. Today we are watching episode 8 of Pretty Little Liars Original Sin. So, last episode, Imogen and Chip ended up getting closer and also kissed towards the end of the episode, which I was kind of confused about because I thought Tabby and Chip had something going on, but I guess not. And the episode ended with A showing the girls that he killed was his, I don't think his name was Greg, I keep saying Greg, Tyler. He showed that he killed Tyler and I don't know where they're really gonna take it from there so I guess let's get into the episode. A texted it to us. You don't think he'll know how the cops got it? I mean, what the fuck can we do? We take deep breaths and don't freak out. Days killed You're already freaking people. out. Probably more. Horrible people us after parties jock centric parties you think it was one of the football players maybe is that how you got pregnant what if we get like a switch up and then it ends up being noah's no, no, boyfriend no, no. i don't think that would happen but, but i'm like that would be a major like major switch up from doing it again nurse simmons is having a blood drive next wednesday Now it's Tabby's mom's turn. No clue. Like, it couldn't be you. Could it? I think you two should leave. Now. Totally. Because she's getting close. Or because it was actually you. Joseph, did you know Angela was raped? Someone told you that? Know what you're getting yourselves into. I... I brought you more money. Is is that what you want? I don't want your money. I want you to drop this now. Of course, they're not going to drop be it. Bad for you. Go, Imogen. Let's go. To me directly, I have a friend at the lab, someone I can trust. And Imogen would need to get hmm. a paternity test. Okay. So you'll do it, mom. You'll it's still not going to be that easy, but it's something. Talk to my friend. We can figure it out, and I'm a risk. We volunteered at the soup kitchen instead. Well, can you do that earlier in the week, and then we'll have Thanksgiving, the three of us? Absolutely, yes. Aww. Written permission from your mother that she's all right with you exploring such dark material. That's fair. You should have just like said something earlier though. Like why oh, wait until then? That's horrible. Yeah, I know. And Sean. Angela Waters. That she was raped before she killed herself. Uh, where did Imogen hear that? Is that She's why to like curve, carve the A in the out. person? When Imogen told me what happened, it stuck with me. Yeah. Imogen, I was oh, awful to you that night. Kelly, I didn't even think she would tell Kelly. I'm here, the reason I'm choosing. Should you still be wearing that brace? I thought you were only supposed to wear it six hours a day, Max. Or for however long it's comfortable. You're not sleeping in it, are you? Of course not, Daddy. Who would sleep in I it? I bet it'd be it uncomfortable. Stay up too late. I won't. Night, Dad. God. Mom. So she's really wearing it attention. too much? Is that so hard? I don't know what your mother's been saying to you, but she is not the victim here. Name, even. He is not your father, Mouse. Fine. Forget it. Well, she deserves to at least know his name. Is she really about to find her dad's name? Gotcha. Aaron, Aaron Stevens. Stevens. Wow. So that's your name. 
dad. So what now? Is she gonna like find him or something? I found my mom's freshman sophomore and volunteers for the blood drive. Great. You can start by making sure people show up to donate. Oh, we will. <laughs> we want blood from everyone. Okay, that doesn't sound suspicious at all. Before we get started, can I make an announcement? Tomorrow is Millwood High's annual Thanksgiving blood drive. Bring away free passes to the Orpheum if you sign up today. I don't understand my mom. Why is he mad? Well, be that as it may, we can't have our students exposed to such. And I wish the world were a better, safer place for young women. But I cannot approve this film for a class assignment. You act like the whole world is okay, seeing so it. I'm gonna go out on a limb here and invite you over Thanksgiving with my family. But every Thanksgiving week, my mom and I used to volunteer at the soup kitchen. I was wondering. Yes. Let's do it. I Automatic I, yes. I, I'm in. I am so in. Really? Okay. Brace double time. It won't speed up your recovery. You need to face this, Farron. There are no shortcuts here. She's regretting it now because she thought she can speed through the process. Hey, but I'll donate. I'll be first in line. I really hope my suspicion is Some not correct because that would suspects. be really. If they don't get blood, I know, but I have a plan B. While the team's practicing. Like your first day. Are they not gonna notice their shit missing? Sid, you need to find out exactly how much they know. How would I do that? Snoop. It's what I'd do. Of course you would. still aren't speaking. Well, that sucks. Cause the movie you wanna make, that's what's gonna get you in NYU. Not some bullshit puff piece for Smithy. You know what? You're not lying. You're right, Wes. Wait right here. Who is that? I get some of those string beans. Oh, um. Yeah. <laughs> Right now. Okay. What just happened? Hey, you're living in Millwood. Forget the six signature. We gotta find the Waters house. If Rose Waters is there, she'll have all the answers we're looking for. Don't tell me the mom's gonna try and stop her. Okay. They really put chips DNA in there. Oh, very cute with your t-shirt rolled up like a greaser. She's so weird, I love it. So she got her address. Is this everything? Yeah, from today and the locker room. And we have the names of every boy who donated blood. Madame Jiri told me she's pushing Giselle for a year. I need to dance, even if it's in some shitty hole in the wall club. <laughs> I really hope you don't get hurt I mean, while you're dancing. Okay, but finally, where have you been? I've been texting. I, I thought she was about to go snooping. And what party? With who? Is she about to I'm piece it to together? Are you alright? Have you been drinking? Here goes the snooping. And then watch Tabitha get home. Okay, okay, okay. 
or not? Favorite clubbing movie of all time. Oh, giving me Indy Parker Posey realness. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Welcome to the Losers Club, Kelly Beasley. I'm kind of happy that Kelly's like in their group. It is two o'clock in the morning, Kelly. Where the hell have you been? And why are you still up? With the girls, I texted Mama. Where else would I have been? Hmm. I don't know. You're just not wearing your uniform is all. She called out your lie. What you gotta say about that? <laughs> okay. Good night then. <laughs> Is that her computer? What are you doing with my laptop? Go ahead and do it. Whatever is going through your mind, just stop living in denial and just say the words and ask me. Anything? Yeah, didn't think so. <laughs> She's really pretending to be a Girl Scout. Wait, did she get her dad's address from that? Hi. Do you know who I am? Dad? Ah, uh, go on inside, honey. She just did that out of nowhere and in front of his other daughter. I don't know what you want, but you need to leave. She'll be going now. I feel bad because all she did, she wanted to meet him, but I mean, like, I feel like it should have been in a different way. And she's about to snoop to see if he's been taking some. He's gonna walk in on her. So he lied. And your daughter. She knows something. Why are you saying that? What's going on? You attacked my son at a Halloween party. Why? What he deserved it. Nothing. I I'm sorry, Mr. Marchand. Things got out of hand, but I... What you and your family are going through, but you need to leave now. Or I'm calling the police. I'm surprised he randomly just showed up like that. Why are you going back to doing that? Oh, she went go visit Rose. Hello? I don't know why that's just clicking. They tied Angela up or something? Yep. So it's the A mask. Joseph. 
So is he A? I'm so sorry. I told you to let it go. Um, how are you gonna get out of there? So is that Rose? And her body's been there? But... A few months ago... Over the summer... She's telling her... Uh, coming home from a party in the woods... It needs to be... Also, one more thing. Call me Karen. Um, um, why? Okay. Considering I saw a corpse, probably Angela's. I was almost killed by Crazy Joe. He has to be A, right? I mean, the mask was there. So what do we do? And we have a set of butcher knives at home. Are they really gonna go after that man? All clear. Nada. No sign of Joe or anyone anywhere. They all brought knives. But gone where? It's Thanksgiving night in Millwood. He left a note. Is that the other yearbook that they need? Our senior yearbook. So... Now, can we call the police? Crazy Joe was A. Could it really be that simple? Based on. Wait till you get another text or something. It never is. I don't know, I kind of find it hard to think that Crazy Joe was A, but in a way, I think he might have been, or he was just framed as A, and like A killed him and like made it seem like a suicide, something. But then it's like, if A is revealed now, what's the next season about? What's the next few episodes about? Because I already know they're renewed for season two. And if they already revealed A, then what does that mean? Like, there's going to be another A? If they do another A each season or something, that's kind of going to be weird. But, I don't know. I feel like there's more to it where it's like I can't guess it correctly. And the fact that Kelly told Greg to call her Karen. That's weird. Why? Well, I shouldn't be asking why. Like, her parents are still kind of pushing her aside as, as if she's like the kid they didn't love, but I don't know. It's all weird. I just really hope I get some more answers in the next episode, so come back for episode nine? Nine. <laughs>